oh, two embarrassments in one day. How could he face each other in the future? In the end, the ceiling beam couldn't withstand the weight and collapsed with that. It turned out to be a prank by his grandson. Just a few days ago, Ed suddenly moved to his daughter's house, occupying Chris' room, and forcing him to move to the attic. Unable to bear it, he issued a tough statement to his grandfather overnight. If he didn't return the room soon, he would be forced to declare war. Ed thought it was a joke and didn't take it seriously. However, on the second night, he installed a high-pitched horn on a toy car, sneaked into the room, and scared his grandfather to the point of so leaving the body. He left a note on his way out, asking him to return the room promptly, and signed a peace treaty with Chris. Ed was just listening to some music, when the record suddenly started spinning faster.